At least if NHL 25 is very fastly approaching, but as I'm making this video, we still don't know who the cover athlete's gonna be. In this video, I'm gonna go over my top predictions on who I think will be the cover athlete for NHL 25 this year. But I wanna keep this an open discussion. I want you to go down in the comments below and tell me who you think's gonna be the athlete this year. And without further ado, let's get into it. For my number one guess, I'm gonna go with Matthew Kachuk. Since being traded to the Florida Panthers, He's blossomed into an even bigger NHL superstar than he'd already been, and he just won the Stanley Cup. Personally, I could see this one being very likely, just with him winning the Stanley Cup and the absolutely two tears that he's been on the last two seasons. Even last year when they made it to the Stanley Cup final, he was a big part of that even though he was playing injured in the final itself. Matthew's trade to the Panthers completely reshaped the Florida Panthers into what it is today, and now they're Stanley Cup champions for the first time in their team's history. My next guess? It's going to be Quinn Hughes from the Vancouver Canucks. Quinn Hughes has took over as one of the top defensemen in the league since he broke into the league a couple years ago, and now he's even captain of the Vancouver Canucks. And with this last season just concluding, he just won his first Norris Trophy. All that combined gives him a very good case and why he should be the cover athlete for this year. Something I would personally like to see though, is I think that they should do a collage on the front of it with all of his brothers and have all three of his brothers be the cover athletes. Personally, I think Jack is very deserving of being a cover athlete too. I know Luke just broke into the league, but it'd still be very cool to have all three of them on the front of the game. Personally, I don't see that collage idea happening anytime soon though, especially because Luke just broke into the league, but I think Quinn Hughes being the lone cover athlete is very likely at some point here soon. For my next prediction, I'm going to go with Leon Dreisaitl of the Edmonton Oilers. Dreisaitl has been one of the top forwards in the league for a long time now, and he's an even better playoff performer. Anything that you can want in a cover athlete, he embodies it. People often forget how dominant he is just because he plays on the same team as Connor McDavid, but he's truly one of the best superstars in the league. The man puts up giant numbers no matter what time of the year it is, and even picks up his production in the playoffs which is just amazing. The only thing I could see slowing this down though is I don't know if he would personally want to be the cover athlete. Let me know what you think about this one though, because I'm honestly not sure. I'm not sure if he'd even want to be the cover athlete personally, but let me know your thoughts. This next one I just think is a very neat idea, and I think it'd be very cool to see. For my fourth prediction, I'm going to go with Sidney Crosby, Evgeny Malkin, and Chris Letang. Sure, they might not be what they used to be, but these three have been a monumental part of the league for a long time now. When you think of the face of the league, you've thought of Sidney Crosby for a very long time. Sure, Connor McDavid's kind of taken that torch now, but Sidney Crosby is still dominant even into his older years. As we all know though, a couple years back, Crosby didn't want Malkin or Latang to leave and they're such good friends and personally, I don't think Sidney Crosby would ever be on the cover by himself because of the often curses that come with being the cover athlete. But if you take him with Malkin and Latang, I think he would be more likely to do it. These three were really responsible for bringing three Stanley Cups to Pittsburgh and I think that's not something that will ever be overlooked. I really want to see Sidney Crosby on the front of one of these games but I don't think he'll ever agree to it unless it's something like this. And without further ado, let's get into my last prediction. My fifth guess on who the cover athlete could be is Nathan McKinnon. Nathan McKinnon is one of the most dominant players in the league, and he just captured a couple more trophies this year, even if it wasn't the Stanley Cup. It seems like every year this guy gets better and better, and he just has that appetite for winning. This dude also embodies anything that you could ever want in a cover athlete never gets into any drama off the ice, and is just there to play hockey and is a good human being in general. He's been a superstar in the league for many years now, and he's proved why he should eventually be in the Hall of Fame once he retires. I think this would be a very fitting thing to have on his resume as well. With all that being said though, I don't know if he would ever agree to being on the cover of the athlete, because like Sidney Crosby, I think he's very superstitious and wouldn't agree to it. Especially when you look at the video game Madden series, you often see the Madden curse that often follows the cover athletes around, and I think that's something that deters even the hockey players from wanting to be the cover athlete. But all of these are just my predictions though. I want to know your predictions in the comments below. Also, if you've made it this far in the video, please consider subscribing, it really helps me out and helps grow my channel. Thank you so much for watching this video, and I'll see you in the next one.